I'm going to skip to the second paragraph. Why are the police facing these problems? It's because small problems can create big problems. Some of the problems are also from schools. Most of the schools use transmission pedagogy. This means that the teachers are just passing words, but students don't understand what the teachers are talking about, and the teachers think students should not talk. So students don't learn to understand the real world or their own context. So they think everything is boring in life, and they start to have fun by taking drugs, smoking, fooling around at midnight with friends. They don't know how to solve the problem. Okay, so I can show you this kind of critique um, that we try to develop in my classes over and over again. The students are pretty proficient now at doing this kind of writing. I can also show you something like this, uh, a sort of spontaneous poem that appears on Facebook uh, that says, when I'm with my mother, I feel safe and warm. When I'm with my sister, I feel strong. Uh, we were uh, practicing repetition. When I'm with my uncle, I feel logical. When I'm with my auntie, I feel energetic. When I'm with Mr. C, I feel there is hope. Okay, Mr. C is me, by the way. Okay. So I can show you these examples over and over again um, and, and make you think, wow, my class is, is this wonderful place. Okay, but we run into great limitations. Um, barriers that not only come from the, the way the school is structured itself, but also with the issues that we're really, uh, dealing with as different kinds of communities. Okay, so this is where I think the students can step in a little bit more, give you an example of the things that we've been working on, uh, which are working pretty well in Form 1, and then some of the big challenges that we ran into this year with uh, Form 2. Let's get this one now. So, uh, Kamran will talk to you first. Kamran. Yeah. 